salmon are a lot of fun to catch. They're big fish. They're in a powerful river. Um, it really makes for exciting times. There's a lot of excitement shared among the anglers on the banks. So far this season, there have been more spring Chinook salmon counted than the 10 year average as more than 50,000 fish have crossed Bonneville Dam, the most since 2016. The conditions out in the ocean have really changed over the last five or six years. We had a period where there was a lot of warm water and uh, unfavorable conditions for our smolts when they entered the ocean. And that's what contributed to the really low returns that we saw from 2017 through 2021. The salmon have experienced a delay on their journey back to Idaho as 3,500 Chinooks have been counted at Ice Harbor Dam, the first one on the Lower Snake, but only 876 have made it to Lower Monumental Dam because of a problem at one of the spill gates that the Army Corps of Engineers is working to resolve. Idaho Fish and Game and the Nez Perce Tribe will push for reduced spill levels if the problem persists, but once the salmon reach Lower Granite Dam, it's time for anglers to gear up. It's really exciting for anglers in Idaho. We're gonna hopefully have one of our better Chinook seasons that we've seen in the last uh, six or seven years. After the salmon pass Lower Granite Dam on the Snake River, they will make it to the Lower Clearwater in a few days, take another week to reach the Lower Salmon, and one more week to reach the area around Riggins. Idaho Fish and Game does a good job of keeping anglers up to date. The IDFG website's a good resource for anglers. We have all of our season and rules information on there that's updated based on the changes that occur in season. And then we also have our regional managers and some of our other staff producing blogs throughout the season to give anglers updates on where the fishing's getting good, any changes that occur to the season structure and things like that. Steve Dent, Idaho News 6.